Well, hello everybody! Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Starmane here. Okay, so let's see what we have happening. What happened last time? Well, I'm trying, I'm trying to remember. It's been a while, so let's just kind of go through the base again, just to kind of give a little tour of what's been changed or what's different. So let's open up this door here. Bang. Oh, I love this door. It's so cool. And then now here's our power our power reactor room. We have the logic down in here that controls these blast shield doors here that I have, which is absolutely amazing. Now this thing does have lights on it spinning around. The reactor inside does. That's what that is supposed to simulate. I wasn't sure what to use, so I used the light rods. And yeah, it seems to work. Um, if I was to redesign these, I would kind of do them a little bit bigger, a tad bigger, but that's okay. To open up the shield uh, in front of them, we just have to activate this guy here. And voila, now we have it all exposed, and now we're able to you know, interact with it. And you maintain this. Now there's a little hole here because of the spinning your core block there. It seems that the, the rods of light here are just a tad longer than the normal block and so you can't put a block here it won't let you because it's obstructed so but that's fine and dandy I still think it looks pretty damn cool I put these lights behind here for whatever reason I'm not sure why but I, I just thought they looked cool same on the other side I do have plans of making these lights f flash at some point but yeah that requires me putting in the logic and yeah, today's episode, I kind of want to do stuff a little bit differently. <coughs> what I need to do is hook up this button with this, so that, when you, uh, that way when you push this, it triggers this to close it. So when you close the doors behind you, it will close the shields, or, or the blast shield, or whatever you want to call it, the radiation shields. It will, uh, you deal with those as well. Okay, so let's go back over to our spaceship because what we, we are uh, tab G what we are going to do let's go no no that's right ships are there okay so we're gonna go to the nearest station and we are going to go to the shop wherever that is which is on the other side of the planet so that's where we're gonna go we're gonna go to that shop so let's jump down here um, we need to buy more weapon systems basically and then we need to I think you buy some more of the shield systems here and I want to load these up with weapon systems I want to load up these empty tubes oh wait I already did never mind I want to test out these weapon systems that's what I want to do because <laughs> I can't remember if last time if I finished with that and I did it on my own or not Let's hop into our spaceship here, to flight mode, let's go into the right camera. Okay, so th I think I made homing missiles, so we're going to have to experiment with that, and that's partially what we're going to do with today. So let's, uh, we're jammed, let's undock, let's pick our missile computer, the damage beam, I don't think I want damage beam, but that's okay, we'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, I launched some missiles already. Oops. <laughs> they take forever to reload, but that's okay. Uh, where can we go to test this out? Well, we need to go to the shop first. So where is that? Where's my arrow? Well, that sucks. So we will have to go to the map. And I want to, I think, fly to this shop here. Actually, let's check out this shop over here, because this is... Oops. Oh, why does it do that? It's so annoying. Okay, so I want to go to this guy here. Let's go plot path to current. Uh, okay, let's go. Now, I think this is where the Laramar asteroids were, and I just want to kind of take a quick peek at them. So, yeah, so I will be right back once we get there. 
Okay, I found this asteroid here, and I kind of just was doing some test shots on it, just to see how much damage these did. So that seems to work, which is good. We do have the cloaking device that we can activate and get out really fast. Not really, though. It doesn't really work too well, so it consumes too much energy on this small ship here. And the missiles, I think, boom, they seem to do all right. So, with that in mind, where's the shop? I think I right over here. So let's go over to the shop here. I want to buy some more of those capacitors and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have them on me. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So these Laramar asteroids are still not not regenerated. I wonder how long it takes before they regenerate. If they regenerate. Maybe you have to you carve the whole asteroid? Let's do that. Let's kind of get rid of the evidence of this guy here. Let's just kind of mass do it. Man, how's everybody been? <laughs> oh, this is not working. Here we go. I've been busy, as always. That's the hard part with having family and having stuff to do. You always you try and find time to play video games and uh, yeah so now is that time that time presents itself so allows me to record because I record when I pl I play like if you notice with the footage you know, lately it's been footage where you've been watching me as I play now the reason for that is because I just find it easier to record and then you put it into my editor quickly bang 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 and then you process a video and upload you know that just seems to be a really easy formula and it seems to get the footage up to maintain the one video a day thing that I've started back in the fall and hopefully it's been successful hopefully a lot of subscribers have come to the channel here just to to be able to watch me derp around and you know, be a little amateur at doing this YouTube stuff. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't want to move towards that. So, yeah. Okay, let's see what we have in here. Uh, da, da, da. I should have brought some carved stuff to make more money with, but that's okay. So, we need to buy... We need to buy... Maybe buy a couple of these... One, two, and maybe one, two, maybe. It's very hard with these things because I'm not sure what these do, right? But in the build mode, let's stop moving. <laughs> in the build mode, maybe that can be answered. So if we look over to the left of the middle screen, we see shields. 1062 by 1062 38 per second so if I place I think one of these guys these these rechargers then I think they'll recharge faster let's see so if I go one uh, 1062 so 44 per second ah, okay so I need more of these rechargers then and that's now where does it say 49 per second so it seems to be adding Five and this will just increase my shield capacity. I think one. I'd put I put one right here. Boom. So we'll fill this in with so one, two, three, four. We need four of those rechargers. Four and three. So it's what seven. So we need seven of these guys. Seven so nice to having money because you can do this kind of stuff okay and then we want to put some more capacitors so then we want to put so if we can go one two three so then I want to put one one two three four capacitors so eight capacitors by amount eight Perfect. Okay, let's finish this off and we'll see 
how well the, the shields perform. Because if these shields go, that's it. The ship is kaputski. And then I'm hooped. So, how do you make a blueprint out of a ship? That's my next question. So let's go into our... Uh, this is ship. Entity structure. Oh, it's... Okay. Interesting, interesting. Uh, oh. Make sure the radio jammer is on. Um, no. Go back into here. Catalog. Save blueprint of entrance structure. Okay, so that's cool. So, ah, uh, here we go, here we go. Uh, salvager Mark Three. Okay. Now what's this Isanth thing? Isanth Four. Is that because I bought? No, no, that's right. That's a player well, one that you can use. And then this is the salvager. And see, it still says created in December 31st, 1969, which is, of course, incorrect. Uh, delete permissions. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm allowed to touch the permissions because I'm an admin or because you can allow other people to use your uh, your blueprint if you want or not I'm not sure how that all works exactly so with that said in mind um, if I die at least with this ship at least I can go b buy and it'll, it'll, it'll create a new one but the mass looks like it's 28.2 which means it's a tiny tiny ship interesting well we saved the blueprint so if the worst happens, let's just top out of our ship here. Uh, I want to see if there's anything in here, and there is, so let's take that stuff out. Now we're going to go to the nearest pirate station. Why? Well, because why not? So if we're right here, where's the closest pirate station? That's the train station. There's a couple undiscovered ones down there. How about what's this one? Undiscovered there. Hmm. Derelict. Trade station. I thought there was a pirate station around here somewhere that we found. They're all undiscovered. Well, tell you what. Let's go over to this undiscovered one here just for the for shits and giggles and see what it is uh, let's see here maybe I'll call this episode exploration or something like that I don't know okay so when I get closer or when something interesting happens I'll be right back okay welcome back here we are approaching this and it's a train station so that's pretty cool so let's check this kind of quality of this train station see what it looks like and we're flying on the edge of the system so that's why you know we're kind of leaving the cloud let's see here oh, this is a pretty cool looking station wow look at that that's pretty neat has a little dome on it too a glass dome up here look at that huh access denied hey Oh, this is cool though. Look at this door. That is so cool. And how are they doing these angles? Oh, I know how they're doing those angle blocks. Okay, that's pretty cool. Huh. Well, this is pretty amazing actually. And see, we got this dome structure here with glass, and there's a bunch of stuff inside there. That's pretty cool. Let's see what Trade Station Alpha has to offer. Uh, same old, same old. <clears throat> Just if you notice, they have zero shop credits because you need to come here to spend credits. They don't automatically have credits, which, which is kind of unusual. I guess we could always stock up credits on here, but then that's kind of doing admin commands, and I don't usually like to do too many admin commands. Jump drive computer. 
I know we need a jump drive computer and stuff as well eventually. Maybe the next ship. I don't know. I do. I know I need to upgrade my ship. So this is a trade station. So that's cool, but not what I was expecting at all. Okay, so let's go back into here. And what's the next undiscovered? Let's go. It's, it's kind of flying back in that direction. Trade station. Let's check out one of these guys. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so you know the drill. <coughs> it's on plot path here. Here we go. Okay, we're on the way to the next one here. I'll be right back when I get there. Okay, welcome back here. Okay, so we're gonna be coming up. Pirate Station Alpha. So I think those ones are good to attack. Uh, what's this one over here? S Station Derelict. Ooh, okay. So I think we're jammed, so they can't really see us, I don't think, unless they are attacking. We just gotta stay out of their way. I wanna experiment with these missiles here oh that's so cool and then launch bang so we do have homing missiles um let's navigation uh, i want to see turrets there we go okay so oh what's this there's fighters here Ooh. So we need to see if we can take out these fighters here. I think it's because I attacked them, right? Okay, so that's okay. Let's see. Bang. Let's see what kind of damage this does and if it takes them out or not. Boom! That's the charge up, of course. Let's watch our shields. Let's fire. Again, is that a good shot? Probably load, 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 load up our missile computer, fire, bang. This is taking forever still. Oh, core overheated. Ah, that did it. We killed one, I think. I think, <clears throat> bang. Not sure what the seconds are. Bang. Next ship. Okay. Come on. I bet you they can't even see me. They don't even know what's going on. That's target up and fire uh, switch I think it's because they can't see me like visually they might be able to see me but let's see what's going on here Oh, watch the damage. Bang. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, okay, I see you. Uh, let's see if we can get you. Yeah. That's right, shoot you son of a bitch. Okay, yeah, 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 I know. You got bad aim. I might have to change that. I don't like it when they have a super bad aim. Makes it too easy. Let's see. Like this. Oh, there we go. Okay. 
Yeah, come on. Should be able to overheat soon here. Bang. Okay. Looks like he's doing 14 damage, right? To the thing. Oh, pirate station killed me. Holy fuck. See, that sucks. Huh. That's probably what the pirate station looks like. Well, that was an interesting battle. So now I'm going to probably spawn at my ship right here. Yeah. So you notice this damage here? What happened is this sector was not protected. And I think what happened is it some pirates were going through the system and were taking random pot shots. So I lost that ship. That sucks. So let's see what it takes to build a new ship. So if we go into uh, what's our catalog? Um, if we go into our catalog and go buy, you're not near a shop. The, the blue stippler itself is free. Okay, really, it's free. I wonder why it's free. Not near a shop. Overrun by min rights. Ah, I still have it though. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, it's because I'm an admin. Ah, uh, I don't want this now. Ah, uh, whatever. We still have to build it, right? So, we need basic gray standard armor wedge. We need cannon barrels, power capacitor, missile tubes, ship cores, blah, blah, blah. We could build all these or buy it all. I think I'm going to buy it all. Actually, I can't because I'm stuck here, right? So, yeah. So, basically, we just need to add all these things into the ship and we'll be able to build it. So, yeah. I think I have to, I'm going to cut the episode here because I've lost my ship and we have to rebuild it. So, thank you, everybody, for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. Uh, trying to take out the pirates. and It seems like pirate ships I can take out, but not the pirate bases, which is unfortunate. So maybe one day we'll have a ship large enough to handle that. And so in the meantime, we'll just have to derp around on our base here. To make this place look prettier, add lights, add places, and all that other fun stuff here. And before you know it, we'll be back at her with a bigger ship to take out those pirate stations. So yeah, so thank you everybody, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.